That's killer. Here she is, boys. Tire swap. Finito. Yeah, this looks killer. Got a new shifter coming. This thing's too short. I'd like something up a little higher. Yeah. I find I'm really grasping for it. So you got that bag strapped down good and tight back there, eh, yeah. bud? All right. Let's see if our let's see if our steering alignment is fixed up. We had to pull the old bolt off the wheel and knock it over. Our last trip out, I discovered I was a little half off. Just gave my buddy Andy a call there. You guys remember him with the nine-wheeler Honda. Well, it sounds like he's added a tenth wheel, as we suggested. <laughs> We're gonna rip on over and pay him a visit and see what he looks like. Right on. What's going on? We got the young lad working on his too. Uh, well, that thing took up smoking. We just had to put a piston in it, and uh, we, without the gear reduction, right? Maybe, I would say he tanned the uh, clutches, so now it's wrapped up a little bit. I wanted to change the oil. So that, uh, I got. Uh, Look at this. Yeah, this goes on a switch. On. Nice and slow. Now I took the same thing, that same motor, the other one, that's an old wheelchair motor, which are brushes and not brushless. Okay. I took the same motor, I had an old uh, 200 Bayou, and I cut the crankshaft off that was blown, Yeah. put a plate on it, and I put that driving the recoil, like we just welded a sprocket on it, and I used to hunt, and that motor would have enough torque that I could pull it up to a tree and spin the back wheel. <laughs> so that's how much torque that motor. So has. you don't have any worries about it having the jam to turn this then? No, I no worries. It's actually 24. I'm only giving it 12. I could give it 24 if I need to, but I think I, because we went back and tried it, and even whenever we were stuck, Jeremy, yeah. all they had to do was pull the roll. I only need a little. Just bit a nudge. Just a nudge. That's I right. I think this is going to be enough to get through. Fuck, I think so too. Unfortunately, that extra weight on the front, it's not, it, the balance is good. I don't need the pails. Yeah. But I should be my springs up. Fuck and I only put it on for a couple of days a year. Yeah, this thing is absolutely deadly. Oh, I do love ripping in the X3. Yeah. It's so comfortable, man. My hip thanks me every time I sit down. Yeah, buddy. This should be intense. You can sit around and whine about it, or you can do something about it. Yeah. When it comes to my these boys do something about it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Thank God. the other way.
that's going to be a problem. Well, I mean, it could be if I don't keep my wheel up on the top, right? Which I might be able to do if I can get my wheel up there. That. We should be okay to do that. Keep that wheel up on the bank. We don't have a lot of room. We can't force the wheels in on each other because that'll just... Officially 10 wheel. 10 wheel drive right now. Although I think he conquered this one without the assistance of that 10th that wheel, but let's see if it helps. It's 
So all that's needed now is the pressure on the rear wheel. We'll then put the traction to the center. Yeah, we're gonna need the back one on. Yeah. Well, that's all right, because that's what it's supposed to do, right? That's all right. That's exactly what she's designed to do. Yes. Oh, yes wow. it's yeah, it's got traction. It's pulling up mud. Yeah. It's just a hybrid, right? Oh, we lost our chain. We lost our chain. So we had a little too much slack going on there, I think. Yeah, need a new spring on there. It'll tighten her up. That, yeah, we just have to worry about the tension of the chain then. Got a pretty, pretty large sprocket on that side. Dang. Okay. You got uh, your three quarter inch wrench. We'll tighten it up while it's in the hole. That way we'll know. Well, it's certainly worth it. It's certainly worth it. And it's got lots of power. Right? Yeah. Once I drive the rear end down, it's going to put that on there. Well, that's exactly That's all that it would have taken right there. We'll adjust it. She'll be made. Oh, no, no, Jeremy wants to come through and show off that. <laughs> well, the black flies are out pretty heavy, eh? I have a thermocell. You ever take those with you? This is the best thing for black flies. They're absolutely amazing. You buy a Canadian tire or anywhere for 35 bucks. It takes a butane cartridge in here. It lights a frying pan. You put pads on. <laughs> I've never even seen one. Like I've never even ball. seen one, man. That's wild. All right, did it gain much tension at all? Or? Yeah, she's tight. I can uh, tighten it more, but I think that's a tight Right on, right on. Timing was impeccable today. Just walk through it, man. You'll be able to go through that like nothing. Oh yeah, but I mean that just walked through it that time. A little better. Yep. Ten wheels is always better than nine. <laughs> just gonna straddle that, come through on its side. Oh okay. yeah. Oh, I didn't add air pressure either. Yeah, definitely. This thing just eats up whatever's in front of it. This is intake on one side. Um, it was through the very back. Not right in the middle. you put on it the better it looks. Quotation's actually perfect. 
side to side is actually not bad, eh? Well, it's a good thing I got my drink just down in perfect. <laughs> Oh, she's right there, Beth. But look at the front pop right up, eh? Good thing I went with a big wheel on the front. Yeah, you want a fat wheel for sure, no. I'll go easy on my tires. I wanted to do a donut so badly. But I just can't do it. I love my tires, but I almost can't resist. Just a little bit splashy, splashy. I got a little bit wet, a little bit, a little bit. Ah, Andy's in there, man. Let's go the opposite way this time. Oh, we'll do that. <laughs> 
In other words, there's some shitty holes, you go ahead. in all these years. Oh, really? Hey, bud. How deep is this? guys till the next time man crazy machine man yeah it's a lot of fun you might know a thing or two about a crazy machine that's for sure all right boys <laughs> 500 bucks eh? yeah deal. you couldn't go better deal man ah oh, great to see these guys man we're gonna have to ride with these guys more often guys <laughs> yeah, he's got too good. No problem.
that looks awesome, man. Wow, is that ever nice? All right, boys, till the next adventure. Oh,